everyone today we will discuss about some of the features of IntelliJ IDEA so we can install so many plugins so whenever we are going to the uh, IntelliJ IDEA welcome screen there is a button here drop down uh, where we can configure so many things so one of the plugin that uh, we are uh, going to discuss today is Google code formatter so uh, basically it will format our code to the modern style so we don't need to worry about that if everyone using the same uh, same formatter uh, there will be a uniqueness am among the developers so we can see how we, we will install that one so in the IntelliJ welcome screen there is configure and under that there is a plugins so we need to click on that plugins then uh, there, there will be a, so many plugins already pop up so we don't need that one so I am just uh, Google Java format that is the one so if you are going here and uh, clicking on that uh, link we will get more information about that Google Java format plugin so this is a 2019 number 4 version so the there is an additional information also there so the vendor is Google so uh, everyone will like that because it's, uh, it's provided by Google itself so yeah and also it's almost 4.3 out of 5 vendor website is there you are going there uh, we can uh, yeah we can get information about where the code resides it's in github right now so we don't need to care about that things there is an issue tracker also if you need to have any issues you can report that that kind of things we can do the versions they also listed the version that's available until release time and also okay so we are not going to discuss about their yeah, their uh, uh, overall things but we are going to install that so i am going to install my google java code restart id so i need to restart my id restart so let's see what is going to happen so i have the intelj idea window here and uh, probably i will take one of the project I don't know which project it's uh, yeah any project is fine so spring trade or whatever project I am going to take it and uh, we will see whether we can format our code based on that yeah here they are asking for whether we need to install uh, yeah whether we need to enable this uh, Google Java format for particular project I just click yes then I'm going for a, one of the project here and I am going to what I am going to do is uh, I'm going to yeah I'm going to make it not formatable then I will try to format based on that so here I select all the cores and I am going to the file not file code uh, there is one code reformat code so reformat code will format my code so right now you can see everyone can see uh, I remove this space right now uh, the code formatter add that space so that's why this works so if we are very 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 big programs it's very useful so if I am saying like list of string I have a list of string and I am giving some name new or a list or something and uh, yeah new or a list or whatever name is fine new or a list and I need to import this one I import that one and uh, I need to disk and then you are list here then after everything I need to add some data to this 
one that doesn't matter because I don't need to sh yeah I don't need to run this code so what I am going to do is I need to copy this one paste it here I will use my string and uh, I will use some of the map functions maybe I will use a filter here so it I can make it bigger so it will ask for something so filter okay I use filter here and I am going to use for each here uh, so maybe the map is fine so I'm going to use the map is here and I am going to collect to list or something map then collect okay this way I can write thereafter I need to select this one and I need to format my code come command line reformat my code so it will format based on that but here there is some issues here so that's why it's not taking that one so we can see how it's going to work here so I'm just going to for each and system dot print the line okay we missed something here out dot print the line okay so right now I have the code and I am trying to format that using the Google reformat my code reformat file dialog okay whole file code clean up rearrange code so I have all these options here so here uh, here nothing happened but uh, eventually we have actually we, uh, whenever we are going to the project or preference or something we need to select that code format and we need to change yeah code formatting code set formatter enable formatter maker default id we need to select that one schema so there is one default id base one but we need to select that google code formatter so yeah here we have uh, but here also I I can't take that imports there is one set from script no no not here so spaces blank is Java dogs okay probably Google Java Yeah, here for the current project enable Google Java formatter, but there is also one option here AOP style Android open source project. Okay, so here if I am, it's almost same I guess. So optimize uh, reformat code. Yeah, the Android's uh, yeah Android uh, uh, style. Have some difference comparing to the Google uh, the same version of the Google okay that's all for uh, Google code formatter next uh, video we will see whenever we are saving something it will automatically format the code so how we will do that in our IntelliJ idea we will see you on next video thank you for watching